I think deciding when to quote experts versus paraphrase them can always be tough because your goal is always to serve your reader. And so I'm always thinking what's going to be the clearest way and often most concise way for me to convey something. My favorite quotes in this piece weren't necessarily about like, well, this is a definition of this, or this is how I'm explaining this. It was sort of adding to the excitement of the piece, um, how weird this was and why people should care about it. And I feel like I'm never as good as talking about that as someone who is working on this or has that sort of expert eye for these kinds of things. So, I mean, one of my favorite quotes from this piece actually came from uh, a B expert who's at Providence College named uh, Rachel, Rachel Benoen. And um, she, I just really loved how she put this, you know, the whole point of the study is about these like adorable little honeybees flying around and gathering poop to smear it on their houses. And she said, we think of bees visiting pretty flowers and collecting sweet nectar. Uh, this is the complete antithesis to that, which I just loved. Um, it was a really great encapsulation. Like if you see bees are gathering other animals poop, read on to figure out why. Um, there's some like dissonance in your head about that. And I feel like she captured it really perfectly. Uh, and she said it far better than I could have as the journalist. And I think when when you notice that, that's the perfect time to have a quote in your piece, a direct quote in your piece.